Well, all right. I guess we are here at the Keg House today for the old Mexican lager. And I can't think of a better day to have a Mexican lager, can you? Uh, welcome to Maine, third rock from the sun. Holy shit. But we got the Mexican lager today. I made a uh, German lager and I put uh, like some uh, grits in it, some corn grits. And I um, also stuck in some uh, sugar, some corn sugar, to make it really dry. And hopefully it's carbonated enough. I would love, love for this beer to be carbonated enough, but I don't think it is, but it's okay. Mexican lager right there, folks. Ah, I used uh, the main, um, Maine plus German um, Pilsner malt. That's my stutter for the day. Look at it outside. It's crazy. Cheers, everybody. Mm. You kind of squeeze that, um, that up a little bit. Mmm. pretty good actually it's not quite um like um, um primed enough um but, but it's getting there and uh it's very dry it has like a um bready kind of feel to it um dry bready corn i like it that's what it's supposed to taste like it's a mexican lager um so yeah cheers everyone God, how about this day in Maine, huh? Mm. But I smashed my wrist last week. I uh, completely shattered my uh, bone here in the top bone, so I had to have a uh, had to have a little um, surgery last week. So that's why I wasn't, um, you know, I'm posting videos. But uh, it's not gonna slow me down. I'll tell you that much. It's not bad. It comes in, this comes in at about uh, 5.4%. So um, it's like a perfect starter beer for the day, you know? So uh, yeah, man, I like it. I'll let you scope it out and that's gonna be it for the day. Cake house, everyone. Cheers, everybody. Check that out. That's, that looks awesome. Uh, yeah, that's that for the day. Oh, Monterey, buddy, it's snowing, dude. All right, everyone, that's it. Cheers.